Long Range 341 here. Today I'm going to show you guys how to use your uh, wireless keyboard and mouse. Of course you're going to need this, the wireless uh, dongle that comes with it, with your phone. All you need, really, is just one of these. It's a uh, micro USB. As you can see, it's a USB. The one I got was $5 at the local computer store. Uh, it's a right angle connector, so uh, to my phone at least, it blocks the headphone jack while I'm using it. That's not a big deal because I have a Bluetooth speaker that I will use anyways. Try to get this in here with one hand. There we go. So you put that up in there and it should open your phone up and show you up here that your phone is in USB host mode. It will do this on uh, Android 4.4 or 4.0 I believe. Both of them. Maybe even earlier versions. I haven't tried it on uh, my old phone. And of course you gotta make sure your mouse is on and I'm missing a pad up here. Oh, it's, it's moved over. Get that back on there before I lose it. And make sure your, if your keyboard does turn on and off, turn that on as well. It might as well be on. Take your dongle. Let's see if this okay. First try. It's kind of an odd thing to happen with one hand. Um, with USB ports at least. Unlock your phone. You should be good to go. Now when you press, say, spacebar, which, uh, I'm going to escape, should maybe, um, it locks it again. Don't know which key locks it again. I don't know, and you press any key and it'll, uh, unlock it. Or you can, uh, move the mouse around. I'm not sure if it'll recognize it. I'll move it over here. Okay, it's gotten the mouse. Oh, you see the cursor? It has a standard cursor. For, um... Like a computer. You can click and drag. It's kind of not as ergonomic as if you're using it, uh, just touching the screen, which you could be doing. But if you are in, per se, Google Drive, it's not, uh, it's a whole bunch of images. Uh, okay. <laughs> Let's figure out how to actually, like, open it document. Camera's not focusing here. I'll light a little bit and we'll get good focus. Okay, um, the scroll wheel does work in the menus. Let's open that back up. My drive. Here we go. Create. Google Docs. Sure, I'll get Docs. Let's get it right now. This should be pretty quick. Just for this video's sake, let's grab a mouse pad. Whoa. Like my uh, hidden focus machine, <laughs> it's a mouse pad. Okay, so that's done downloaded. And find the mouse again. Bring this back up. Create a new dock. Perfect. 
Okay, guys. Sorry about that. I'm back. That was kind of. I'll cut that part out. Okay, so just wake the phone up. As you can see, that's my car. So we're in a new uh, dock, which a keyboard won't come up on the phone. What do I do? Nope. Let's not drop it. You can actually type I'm just typing random characters and the response is great because as soon as I press the button it goes up I actually started changing the title but, um, number keys actually it's number lock on when you turn number lock on the keys work the uh, number pad of over here which is quite neat and the arrow keys do work moving the cursor backspace, uh, this one has an auxiliary backspace up over here and the one over here, I'll see if this one works it does like my um, amazing typing skills there with one hand but yeah that's how you use it and if you have it set up and you need to type a document but all you have is your phone and somehow your, your keyboard um, along with your mouse, you don't even have to have your mouse, just a keyboard, you can plug in it's kind of interesting, I found out that if you just uh, unplug this, I mean, don't mind my cat and I have this old optical uh, well that one's an optical mouse, this this optical mouse as well but I mean these good old boys old Microsoft uh, I'm gonna big red light on the back that was like really annoying I couldn't have it in my room I had to find a different one to use um, wired mouse you'd think it'd draw too much with the light and everything guess what just the moment of truth can't even plug the USB in correctly shove it in there the mouse is on keyboard you don't have a keyboard the keyboard comes up on the phone at this point in time but the mouse does work and you can click the keys on the keyboard with it so if you have just a mouse and you don't feel like sitting there doing this you can set your phone up and just sit there and click keys which is really like unergonomic I don't know why you do that I believe you can click and hold and it does yes But yeah, that's how uh, you connect a mouse up. It's just a little $5 adapter. Actually, you can probably get them for less on Amazon. I may have a link if I find one. Uh, but that's it. Thank you. Bye. Oh yeah. I'm not going to beg you to uh, like, like and subscribe and stuff, but you should. Oh yeah. And uh, I'm just delaying this, if you don't mind, because I like I like this. It's shiny. I know you like it too, because there's percent signs and stuff. Look at it. Look at it. Looks like the five is cussing a lot. Yeah, that was an <laughs> an added comment that didn't need to be there. Yeah, how do you like, guys like my uh, phone? Although I, the only complaint I really have about this phone, it has amazing processing power. Works really great. This lens, as you can probably see, those aren't fingerprints. Those are all scratches. I have it normally in an outer box case, and it's just a rubber bit, and it still scratches. Managed to get something to get down in there and scratch it. It's all scratched up. The images just don't come out as clear as they should. Yeah. So um, I've I've heard of other people experiencing this, but uh, well, I just moved the mouse. Yeah. So that's it. Ta-da.